Welcome back to our channel. At this video we will learn new Primavera P6 tricks. At the end of this video, you will be able to know how to use resource leveling in Primavera P6. This is totally free tutorial, so don't forget to support us by clicking the thumb up and subscribe. Without wasting time, let's start. As per our program here we can see that our start date for this project is April 21st, and the finish date is June 17th. Now I want my activities to plan based on my resources availability. First, I will assign a resource to all activities here. So, I will select all activities, and then mouse right click and choose assign resources. As an example, I will assign the steel fixers resource to all. Now I will change the default resource value. So from enterprise then I will choose resources. From default unit per time, I will change the default value from 8 units per day to 2 units per day. Now if I schedule my project, the plan start and finish dates will not change. But if I want my activities to be driven and change based on my resources availability. For that I have to activate an option, so that our activities duration will be calculated based on the available resources for that activity. So from schedule I will go to the options here. I will select this option here called level resources during the scheduling. This means that durations will be based on the resources available. Now we will schedule the program, and we will notice the start finish dates changes here. Now I will schedule my project, and we can see the changes at the start date and finish dates. So, my project plan dates have changed as per the availability of the resources. This is a quick review on how we can plan our activities with limited resources in Primavera P6. Thanks for watching.